Hey, 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 everybody. Welcome to my channel, Tea Girl Magic Tarot. Yeah, yeah. Here to do a reading for my lovely, beautiful J -j 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 Gemini. My Gemini's. What's going on, Gemini? High vibe, cross watchers. Everyone is loved and welcome here. Thank you guys for joining me. Thank you for all your continued love, your support. Thank you for your subscriptions, your likes, and your shares, you guys. Donations, book readings, just everything, Gemini, high vibe, okay? Um, I am going to be doing, I am open for readings for a few more weeks, and then I'll be closing that down for quite, for some time until Spirit tells me to open it back up, okay? We don't know when that'll be, but approximately probably one to two weeks, I will be shutting it down, and I appreciate everyone for all their support, all their love, all their healing vibes, and everything, okay? So, thank you again, Gemini. High vibe. Come on, choir. Come to the front. <clears throat> One, two, three. Oh, T-Girl, T-Girl, Magic and Collective. T-Girl, 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 Magic and Collective. T-Girl, T-Girl, Magic and Collective. Come check us out and see what we're about. Ooh. We are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. We are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Yay! Give the choir a round of applause. Yes. Okay. Well, I don't know what's going to be about, but I have been feeling that sad, depressive, heavy energy, Gemini, in your energy now. Now, I don't know if it's you or somebody else, but there is a, a there's a masculine. I don't want to say if he's he's a divine masculine because this this energy that I'm picking up is not a divine masculine, okay? Um, and the upright, let me put it that way. They're extremely depressed, regretful, um, sad, and I'm also picking up a masculine, feminine energy. So I am picking up the energy of a karmic, okay? Whether the karmic be your karmic twin flame or the person that your person got with is the karmic, okay? And these energies are depressed. They're not in a good space right now, okay? There's no new beginning um, with them, and they want to come reach out towards you to ask for forgiveness and start again. This person is extremely jealous of you. Um... They have a love-hate relationship with you, and they, like I said, they're extremely depressed because things aren't moving forward with you guys. Or you've gone through a transformation, and you just pretty much love don't live here anymore. Not that you don't love this person, but yeah, you had to leave this person out in the cold, and now they're feeling sad and depressed, and they're actually feeling be stabbed and back, betrayed and backstabbed. Now, I do want to let you know that there is a masculine energy that has left their karmic energy. Their karmic is extremely upset. They're feeling backstabbed and betrayed. Yeah, they were very controlling. So if your person was a narcissist, they met their match with spirit telling me. So now your person's gone and left them out in the cold. And your person is also possibly having a transformation as well. Okay? Which the karmic now is feeling backstabbed and betrayed. Okay? They're blaming you for this transformation of the karmic that left you. Even though they're birthing karmic energy, okay, one is having a transformation and the other one's stuck where they're at right now. Now, also, I'm beginning um, this karmic energy, this female karmic that's in her masculine energy, she's doing spell work. Oh, yeah, she's did, doing spell work, child, and now I don't know. She's did now for some of you guys it's gonna resonate different. Only take the energies and resonate. It may not resonate with anybody. And if it doesn't fly, just if it doesn't apply, let it fucking fly, okay? But now this karmic energy is doing spell work to bring you back to them. They're doing some type of sex magic or whatever the case may be. Also, this karmic energy is putting spell work on the masculine's genital area, okay? So they won't be able to have relations with anyone else, okay? Um this person is very stressed out. Your person is going through a lot right now. They possibly have, I'm hearing they pushed the limits. They went too far and to the point of no return. And now this person can't return. They can't come back. They can't revive a new beginning. They can't heal anything. And every time they think about what they've done or they possibly, well, they're in regret because they know this. I'm getting the ace of wands and I'm getting a lot of sex, okay? So this person pretty much based this relationship. Oh, I'm hurt. I'm hearing also they called you a hoe. 
whoever this energy is, they called high vibe a hoe. They said you was a slut. Yep, that's what they said, spirit. Yep, and that's why another reason that they left you up. So someone lied on you, Gemini, high vibe, cross watcher, whatever you are. I'm picking up they were jealous of what you did for your occupation. Okay, I don't know. I don't know. Some of you guys are in the financial industry. Some of you guys are in sales. Some of you are... I'm, I'm hearing strippers, okay? It is what it is, you know? Not everybody, but... This person thought they were better than you and they casted judgment up on you. And they did. They're in agony because they did a magic spell on you, Gemini, to cause an ending to your health and your poverty. Um, up to the health and your money, baby. I'm sorry. Uh, they... They did a magic spell to cause an ending to your financial health and your financial wealth, okay? But you're blessed, and this person's in their head now because they got forewarning from God to stop, bitch, stop. You got to see, God has got his hand up. He's like, if you keep doing this magic, I'm going to put, I'm going to have to sit your ass down, sir. So now they didn't listen. They still did some type of magic. Now this is for, okay, let me just tell you this. The karmic female energy did magic on the masculine to keep them stuck, possibly did magic on their genitals or whatever the case may be to keep it from not functioning properly. And then you got a divine masculine or a karmic energy that's doing spell work on you to keep you from uh, receiving love and new beginnings. And But regardless, the energies have went returned back to the sender. Yeah, this is return, honey. When God lifted his hand up and said, that's, that's like God speaking. And it's, and it's being returned back to the past, okay? So whoever this energy is from your past that sent dark magic to you, Gemini, high vibe, cross watcher, I'm hearing both of them, both of them. It's the karmic, both karmics, male and female are doing magic or attempted to do magic, but now they're in a poverty stricken um, environment right now, okay? And a lot of them are upset because some of you have elevated on, um, you guys are have your own platform. You're on top of the world right now. You're on a world um like you're on the internet, okay? You have access to the entire world. And these people see whatever you're doing. You some have some of you have online. This is retrograde, y'all, okay? So forget my more tight. I'm already tied, tongue, and twisty. It's going to get worse, okay? Um, They want to heal. Oh, I'm telling you, you know what? And for some of you, this masculine energy, they cannot believe that they see you on stage, wherever they see you, wherever you are. They can't believe how protected and how healed you are, how balanced you are. This is turning this person on, and they are also in regret as they're getting turned on by you. It's like being starstruck. So this person's starstruck. I don't know. I'm getting celebrity vibes from some of you guys, okay? And now they're all in their head because they caused the ending to something that could have been so beautiful, and they could have had or been in this hierophant energy. Or they could have been this hierophant practicing or doing this magic to backstab and betray you, but they only even trap themselves, okay? Ooh, that's a lot. Okay, what else, Holy Spirit? Uh-oh, we got the eight of wands, that's communication, but in this case, it's magic, the magic backfired, okay, and now they want to make a small offer towards you, of apology, I don't know, the ace of pentacles, what's the ace of pentacles, Holy Spirit, what is this ace of pentacles, because that's a new beginning, they want to take a leap of faith and forward movement with this ace of pentacles, because I told you, they see you on the platform, spotlight as the star, you guys are healers, okay? You guys are um, looked up into the um, spiritual realm as far as uh, your high ranking. That's what I want to say. Your high ranking, high vibe, and you got the authority and the approval of God. At the end of the day, God's got your back. This person's pissed off because they caused the ending to themselves when they tried to leave you out on the call, not knowing that this, this is God to me, okay? This is God, and this is why they're feeling foolish and stupid, so tell me more about this desolate energy. So why did this person, why did the masculine leave the raggedy karmic? Like why, what happened between them? So, okay, something in a marriage, something in a marriage, something in a marriage. Somebody got cut, cussed out, I don't know. Maybe the karmic energy turned cold into tap. Oh, damn. Somebody was a hoe where they was hoeing around and then possibly somebody got somebody ill, okay? Just ill, like ill. <clears throat> And walked away. So I don't know if this, who walked away, Spirit? Somebody walked away to balance out the scales or to balance out their life. So maybe this masculine, yeah, this masculine realized how dirty and low down this karmic energy was. Possibly got them sick. But because you're a healer, 
Okay, they they feel that you can heal them, and I that's confusing to me. Like, why the fuck would you think? I mean, I know you are a healer, Gemini, high vibe, whoever you are. It could be any zodiac sign that's in this high vibrational energy that is a healer. But because but you can't heal somebody so toxic. This person is low vibration. I'm talking about extremely low to the floor, underneath the ground, child. And, yeah, they just desolated. They, they're they trying to get back to this family situation. They're all in their head about this Ten of Cups because you truly were their Ten of Cups, Gemini. Yeah, this person suffers from high stress, high anxiety. Okay, they're always balancing. I mean, they're always miss. They're using people. This is a user right here, okay? So this person is, they have a lot of sex and they're reflecting back on all the experiences that they had sexually. Some of them can't remember or don't know where they got sick from if they are sick. And that's not for everybody, okay? But I'm just telling you, it's very possible that it could be for a few of you because this person does not like to use protection, if, that, if you know what I'm saying. They like to do it, they like to have sex um, raw back, and they like to have threesomes, okay, they like to have threesomes with all types of sexes, okay, um, and some of them do it for the money, okay, they do, they do it for money, okay, and now there's been a cycle of completion for this person, like I said, possibly their health, and they're going through a tower, what else, and I have been picking up baby energy too, so I'm, it's, it's possible for some of you guys that they got this karmic pregnant, pending on who is the baby daddy, and so this masculine left this karmic out in the cold until they figure out who the fuck the seed is of this motherfucking baby, okay? Who's the seed of the baby? Yeah, Gemini. So they are stressed the fuck out. This person feels that they should have married you when they had the opportunity. But this person needed to heal. And this is why you were sent to heal this person. But they repeatedly left you out in the cold over and over and over again. But this last time that they left you out in the cold, loved ones, you went through a transformation. This person never expected you to go through a transformation the way you did and heal. See, the Holy Spirit fell upon you and wanted, and caused a healing within you. Okay? And caused a new beginning. You have a new passionate spark about life. You're now in this Ten of Cups energy. Wish fulfillment. Emotional. Okay? Some of you are just being the best moms and parents, some of you are finding wish fulfillment not in a relationship, but within yourself, in your own life. You're balancing out yourself, okay? Because you're balanced out and you've gone through a transformation and a lot of you are more spiritual. You've had a spiritual awakening and of elevation and you're closing out cycles that no longer serve your highest good at all. The people that, you know, that are users, abusers, risk takers, you know, liars, Decepticons, all of that, you're closing cycles out to that. And this is causing a tower for this masculine energy. This masculine energy is also having an awakening where they want to leave things. They want to mirror you. So they're kind of mirroring you, Gemini high vibe, but they're like kind of like on the tail end of things where you're pretty much already ahead of the game. You're 10 steps ahead and the cycle has already been closed for this to be renewed. Okay, they want a renewal. And you don't want a renewal, Gemini. This person kept you, this person brought a lot of anxiety out in you, even though they were your Ten of Cups. And that's because, you know, they brought a lot of anxiety, okay? They had a mind half full set, they had a glass half full mindset, which in turn, like, you had to close out that cycle to that because you are in an abundant mindset. You, I feel you always were, and you were trying to help heal this person to bring them into a Ten of Cups energy, Okay, this person does suffer from anxiety. And Gemini, some of you guys suffer from anxiety, okay? A lot of you are suffering from anxiety is because this magic that's being thrown at you. You have to learn how to recognize the energies that are, if it's coming from you, is this of you? You know everything is fine in your life. You know everything is good in your life. You're balanced out. So why are you stressed out and why are you anxious? Oh, yeah, it's not your energy, babies. It's someone that's going through a transformation. They don't want things to change with you, okay? They don't want you to change. They don't want things to be, they want things to remain the same is what I'm saying, okay? Yeah. They could be a King of Pentacles energy, a Virgo, Capricorn, or a Taurus energy. Could be a Taurus with the Hierophant here, okay? But um, this person wants forgiveness and they want commitment, but they, I, tell me more about this. Well, so why is this person trying to come back to Gemini spirit? 
yeah, they want to forgive, but then they left the karmic, and then they want to come back. Like, I don't understand that part, Spirit. Help me understand. The two of swords, they made a decision because they're not going through such, through such great times right now. They're seeing you over here in the star energy, the ten of pentacles, I mean, sorry, the ten of cups energy. You are this king of pentacles energy as well, loved ones, and you are this hierophant energy too, okay? They're crying and sad and stressed out because they couldn't see your worth and they didn't see you for who you really were. They didn't know that you were literally in the middle of having a transformation, so now they're feeling stressed out because they cut the King of Pentacles, the Hierophant energy out, the King of Swords energy out, Gemini, high vibe. They cut you out, okay? And that what ended, that's what completed a cycle. And ever since then, they have been having towers. So now they want to come back. This energy wants to come back to you. And also the karmic female, she want to come back. She want the masculine to come back, okay? But um, the masculine want to come back because you're receiving good fortune. The will is finally turned in your favor, okay? And you're getting contracts and celebrations. But they want to come and put in teamwork and collaboration as well. Oh, my God. But this person, like I said, I don't know. It's probably too late, too little, too late. They want to come rushing them, but they could possibly be sick. Um, things are laid to rest. Things are not moving for them. They don't have any forward movement. And this is what's stressing them out as well because this is their karma because they fucked over the earth angel, okay? They deceived the earth angel. They lied to the earth angel. They tried to play the earth angel. And all you were trying to do, Gemini, was love this person and give them some type of um, wish fulfillment. Be their wish fulfillment. But they couldn't They couldn't see the forest for the trees. They couldn't appreciate your energy, your, your goddessness, your love, your stardism while you were here, okay? Now they want to come in, rush it in taking a leap of faith on you, okay? Be careful. This person is pissed off, though, because they feel that you should take them back. Yeah, this King of Swords energy is sick. Not not only, not my high vibe, okay, Ma? This is, I'm, I am picking up a King of Pentacles energy, and I am picking up an air sign energy. So it could be either an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. It could be a, a earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. And they're entrapped. Now, this person could also be possibly oh they have done so much in their life you guys that they have literally so this i feel bad for this king of swords energy my god jesus uh, the magic that they've done and they do oof child so they're possibly sick that's number one okay um their money is moving slow things have come to a complete halt they're not doing really good they're penny pinching they're sleeping from pillar to post and they possibly also have a court like a court case coming up where they might be facing jail time for some type of accident that they were involved in the king of wands in reverse energy this person took action in the wrong way they possibly got into a car accident doing something too quick not using their discernment okay possibly arguing with the karmic that that left them or they left okay arguing with someone they got into a car accident so yeah, somebody who they were in a relationship with. Yeah, the king of the knight of wands energy. And spirit says some of them possibly had an accident. I'm just keeping 100. Um, they were getting hit, driving in the car for a lot of them. Yeah, and then they had a car act, okay? And now they got to pay the price because possibly someone got injured, you know. And yeah, they got somebody, they got legal issues, you guys. They got legal issues, okay? Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, this is a person that um, is extremely selfish, extremely arrogant, extremely greedy, only for self. They do things what's in the ben best benefit for them. If it doesn't benefit them, they don't want to do it. They don't want to work on it. But because this person's going through so much of a tower, the judge has ordered something. I don't know what the fuck. The judge is, the judge is, yeah, girls and boys, the judge has sentenced this person. What's the, what did the judge sentence them, sentence them to? Because they're sad. They cannot believe it. And they spying on you. What did the judge sentence this person to, spirit? Because, yeah, they did have some type of accident. They do have some type of illness from sexual activities, you guys. Okay? Um. Yeah, they're sad. They're going through a small depression. I said a small depression. Yeah, they're going. They're depressed about the past, you guys. Look how they're depressed about you. You could be dealing with a Virgo. Don't have to be, but they're they're sad about um, this this keeping putting you in a competition, putting you 
in a love triangle. You know, giving to two besides, giving to others besides you. Being in an illusion confusion for being in their shadow side, for investing in some bullshit that really still got them trapped and stuck. Okay, they got, they still need money. Whatever they did it for, they didn't get, the, they didn't get, whatever uh, desire they were expecting out of whatever that they did, they did. Because this person kept feeling that they were able to come back to you at any given time, whenever, whatever, however. Because they took advantage of your love, your Queen of Cups energy. Though she didn't show up, but that's the energy that I'm feeling. Theirs was more sexual based and yours was more of a healing out of love situation. They wanted to put it so, yeah, mm -mm. tell me more spirit about this energy. So they do want, they see you being victorious and successful. Um, some of you guys could be an athlete on this, you know, in front of a lot of people. You guys are winners, okay? Um, but this person's extremely jealous of you. They see you getting acclimates. They see you being very victorious. They see how protected you are. Um, yeah. And they want to know if they can come down your way. And Gemini says, Gemini says, no, you cannot come down my way. Yeah, you made the decision. Look, you cannot come down my way, ma'am or sir, because you're too fucking petty. This is a very low vibrational petty tit for tat energy. You know what I mean? They don't they don't know how to let things go. They hold on to every fucking thing. This person holds on to the past. They hold on. So you could think things are cool. You could be like, oh, yeah, I forgive you. I'm sorry. Things are over and let's move forward. No, this person's still petty. They're plotting about how to get you back. Yeah, so this this is that's the energy this person is in. It's how to get back, get back. Mm. And then number one, get back to. I, I I don't feel good energy from this person though. Yeah, well, tell me about the judgment spirit. Yeah, the judgment's been called on this person though. They want to they want to balance things out, but I think they really want to fuck up your nine of pentacles energy. Some of them want to get you knocked up, child, with a devil ass demon. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm keeping it. They want to get you knocked up with a demonic child. And I'm saying a demonic child because this is the agent of the devil that you have been intertwining with. You are the angel of light and they are the angel of the darkness, okay? And you know that. They have manifested and showed you who they are. Not to say that they couldn't have changed, but the path that they took was already sealed and dealed, okay? The judgment had already been made. Soon as they did what they did, there's, this, this, there's a point of no return at this point. God can only forgive, but it's about the intentions of this person. And this person's intentions were not good for you, Gemini, high vibe. All they wanted to do was cause a heavy burden for you. Okay? They wanted to cause a heavy burden for you and then walk away from you and keep you st stuck, stagnated, and waiting. Okay? They didn't want you to excel and climb as you are. But anyway, um, so the karmic energy, she's sad, she's stuck. I'm hearing she's a little bit of suicidal because she's stuck with this baby. Or for some of them, okay? She's looking at about what she invested in because she thought that if she would have child, I don't know, she made a deal with the devil, child to be child, and the devil did not come through for her. Like she thought that the devil would do. And I'm thinking, like, well, what the devil's a liar. Why would you even believe the devil's coming through? He's not. He's never gonna come through. Even though he say he do, he not. So now she's under judgment right now because of the spell work that was done. And some of them, they possibly went to, ooh, I'm hearing also, for some of you guys, this hierophant energy is this king of swords. So they could be an occult leader, an occultist, something going on, dibbling and dabbling in the dark arts to stop your victory and success. That shit was an epic fail, spirit said. And now they're burnt, clapped, crunching, crunching, homeless, sleeping from pillar to post. You know, low key, high key spirit says, not little low key, high key, um, giving their bodies away just for a bite to eat. I mean, that I want to laugh so hard because I cannot imagine. And I and I never, I'm not laughing like ha ha. It's just so like overwhelmed. It's like, oh my God, are you really prostituting for a bite to eat? Babies, if you are, you don't have to do that, okay? You do not have to do that, okay? Um, God has provided everything. You need to up your faith. You need to up the ante in your faith in God and put into the test that he going to come through because you don't need to be doing this low vibrational shit to get a bite to eat, okay? I'm just saying. Uh, woo! Child, what else, spirit? This ain't everybody. This is for some of the lower vibes that are, are actually doing that for a bite to eat. And I mean, I get it's survival, but I mean, God is survival because if without God, you don't survive. So what are you doing? You understand what I'm saying? 
Yeah, this person wants justice with you. They're doing this because they want money. They want, so whoever I was talking to, it doesn't matter at the end of the day, but this energy, this masculine right now, they want to come to, I don't know, they really want to shut you down. They're jealous. So they're going to come in all with full of love. And so you were in a relationship with this person long term because we've got the eight of cups right here. And then they walked away and left you stuck, which in turn stuck they asked. So now they want to come back with apologies of I love you. You know, I'm sorry. Let's get together let's work it out could be dealing with a leo don't have to be but they want to tend to cuss with you and you just don't want it no more and it is what it is and they feel like kind of sad if this person approaches you gemini stay away from this person they are mentally imbalanced i did see the nine of wands right here um they are mentally imbalanced oh let me get my oh shit hold on y'all wait a minute um, um shit hold on i have some candles burning and um, they had melted down. And I was like, let me get that, you know. Oh, so yeah, Gemini. Um, I think that's it. Just stay away from this energy. They are um, they're unstable mentally. They blame you for a lot of shit that has nothing to do with you. Um, both of these energies are blaming. They have a lack of accountability. And they both have mental issues, to be honest with you. And very extremely depressed because life is not working out for them. You're the star. You're in the spotlight. Will's turn it out in your favor. You got good shit going on, Gemini. You got good vibes. You got contracts, judgments. Like, God has got you. And they're mad. They're confused. And how are you still fucking standing when they're, feel, when they're stuck? But it is what it is. You get what you give. And that energy that they sent out, they got that shit right back, Gemini. Okay, my loves, I love you so much. Until next time, I'll see you soon. Bye.